My name is Duke. I worked on the Mitsuda Railway with many other engines. I used to work with engines named Stuart, Falcon, Jim, and Atlas. But there was an engine named Stanley. He would always derail and spill his loads. And every time I came to his rescue, he would always say, Ah, who cares for a few spills? We do here, youngster. One day, Manager was fed up with all of his derailments, and he turned him into a pumping engine behind our shed. One day, I was in the shed sleeping one afternoon, when I heard an engine puffing down the wharf. It was Edward with a flat car, but I was wondering what the tarp was. What's under the tarp, Edward? You'll see soon enough, Duke. I was still thinking what was under the tarp until my driver came up and we had to go for our next train. Early in the morning, Stewart woke me up telling me there was a surprise behind the shed. Come on, Grandpa. There's a surprise we need to show you. And um, we don't exactly know how you're going to react to it. At this time, I was not steamed, so Stuart had to push me down the siding to the surprise. When I saw the surprise, I was very shocked, surprised, and kind of scared. It was Stanley. Then... I was reminded about the past on the Mitsodo. What are you doing here, Stanley? The Earl of Sodor saved me. You should have been left at the mines as an old pumping engine in one of those buildings. Falcon and Stuart were very surprised, and I was surprised at myself for what I just said. But at that time, I was too angry to notice. Grandpa, why would you say that? Because that's the truth. I always hated Stanley even back at the Mid-Soto Railway when he had accidents all the time. And the things he said to me. Now, if you excuse me, excuse me, well, I have enough steam pressure to move on my own. And I'll be going back to the shed. I'm so sorry, Stanley. Um, I don't know what's up with him today. I know what's going on. It's the past between me and him. Boy, oh, I regret everything I said to him. Every time I pass Stanley, he tries to say hello or whistle to me. I always ignored him, and again, I wish I never did. I would always say that would never suit his grace, but right now my grace would not approve of my attitude. Atlas, I don't know what to do. Duke will not accept my apologies. He will not say hello. He will not whistle back to me. I don't know what to do, Atlas. I don't know, Stanley. I think this is just a grudge that Duke has been holding for years now. Maybe at some point Duke will just accept your apologies. I know him, and, he, and he's an old engine, and wise too. Do you think Duke is ever going to forgive me? 
I don't know, Stanley. I really don't know. Look out! Look out! Runaway trucks! Runaway trucks! Stanley, I don't know if you can hear me, but I'm going to say this anyway. I'm sorry for not forgiving you, sorry for not saying hello, and sorry for not whistling at you when you try to whistle to me. I just hope you can forgive me for the things I've done over the past week.